Sun Unified School District is set to receive $3.2 million from the Altria Group in a second settlement due to students vaping. News for Tucson's Daniel McFarland joins us now with the details live. Daniel. Well, Sean, you probably heard about a lawsuit being settled back in March. Well, that was the first part of this. Now, this is more so geared towards the parent group and has a lot more to do, of course, with marketing than vaping itself. Over the last few years, many students, high school and college, have thought vaping is safer than the alternatives. I don't really see anything wrong with it as long as you're not trying to smoke cigarettes. The settlement was largely about the marketing and less about access to vapes. The TUSD group involved with this lawsuit was one of the bellwether cases that represented many different school districts around the country. This is $3.2 million with the Altria group. Uh, the um, and that's that's gross. There would be, of course, uh, attorney's fees that would come out of that. Uh, the plan for this uh, $3.2 million in terms of payment would be um, sometime in the next four or five months, um, all in one in one payment. Um, and this would this would wrap up uh, the settlement would wrap up the litigation with Jewel. 25% of the settlement will be going to the lawyers, which will be $800,000, and the other $2.4 million will be going to the district itself. So as you heard, this is going to be the end of the Jewel lawsuits when it comes to TUSD, and in total between the two settlements they have with Jewel and their parent company, it comes out to $9.2 million. Back to you.